This bill is undoubtedly better than it was at the start. It couldn't help but be because of all the effort people have put into it in making it better. But it is still the most appalling piece of legislation. And I'd like to read you something. Today, an ordinary person can't pick up the phone, email a friend or order a book without comprehensive records of their activities being created, archived and analysed by people with the authority to put you in jail or worse. I know I sat at that desk. I typed in the names. When we know we're being watched, we impose restraints on our behaviour, even clearly innocent activities, just as surely as if we were ordered to do so. <coughs> the mass surveillance systems of today, systems that preemptively automate the indiscriminate seizure of a machine that simply cannot operate without violating our liberty on the broadest scale, and it permits governments to go back and scrutinise every decision you've ever made, every friend you've ever spoken to, and derive suspicion from an innocent life. Even a well-intentioned mistake can turn a life upside down. To preserve our free societies, we have to defend not just against distant enemies, but against dangerous policies at home. If we allow scarce resources to be squandered on surveillance programmes that violate the very rights they purport to defend, we haven't protected our liberty at all. We have paid to lose it. And that, I think, sums this bill up. That was written by Edward Snowden, who, as he says, sat at that desk. And it was written by Liberty. And I think that this is a piece of... Um, would the noble lady accept that actually Edward Snowden, by releasing millions, millions of bits of classified material, has actually made all of us less safe than we were? That is an absolute certain fact that he has done that. And it's hardly someone to quote as a great and noble person. I think what we'll find in the future is that this legislation is something that comes back again and again to bite us, and I think that many of us here will regret having passed it.